Well, let's talk about encoding and decoding. I have a variable here. Z is equal to kata. It's a Korean word. It means to go. I hit enter. Now, I'm going to key in Z2 equals. Now, you know that Z guy? Yes. I want you to encode him using UTF-8. And then when I key in Z2 again, take a look at what we've got. We've got this binary encoding. Now, let's reverse this. I'm going to make a Z3. I'm going to make it equal to the following. A Z2. I want you to decode yourself. Now i got to hand them the original encoding method, UTF-8. And it's done. Did it work? Let's find out. I key in Z3. And if this worked, I should see kata in Korean. Korean characters. Here we go. And bada bing, it worked. Amazing. And that's about all I have to say for now. Thanks so much for listening. If you enjoyed the video, please rate it. I'd appreciate that. And I hope to see you in the next video. Bye-bye now.